on Capitol Hill an outpouring of support for a lion of the Senate. Senator McCain is an American hero. He's a hero to our conference. He's a hero to our country. Here in the Senate, he's a friend to almost all of us. From the bottom of my heart, I wish him and his family well. So does every member of this chamber. The respect that this man has is broad and deep. A man who survived five years as a prisoner of war in Vietnam, John McCain's legendary grit and determination propelled him to six terms in the U.S. Senate and two White House bids. I know who I am and what I want to do. Never one to sugarcoat words, McCain has not shied from criticizing the Trump White House. Obviously, there's a administration that is in significant disarray. As a candidate, Trump had sharp words about McCain. He's a war hero because he was captured. I like people that weren't captured, okay? I hate to tell you. This week, the president spoke in more conciliatory terms. And I can tell you, we hope John McCain gets better very soon because we miss him. He's a crusty voice in Washington. Plus, we need his vote. McCain's absence is particularly ill-timed for Senate Republicans who could not muster the votes to reform health care even before the Arizonans' devastating right. diagnosis. It's pretty clear that there are not 50 Republicans at the moment to vote for a replacement for Obamacare. Now Republicans will be one member short for an unknown length of time, just as they face intense pressure to act. People are hurting. Inaction is not an option. A make or break vote on ending Obamacare is expected next week with or without McCain. Former Senator Edward Kennedy was stricken with the same form of cancer in 2008, yet was able to work for more than a year before succumbing to the disease. Should McCain resign, Arizona's Republican governor would name a temporary replacement who would keep the seat in the Republican caucus. But raw political calculations were not at the forefront of Senate action Thursday as the chamber rallied behind a revered member. Oh God, our shield, look with favor upon us to place your healing hand on Senator John McCain. Astound us with your power. Michael Bowman, VOA News, Today, the Capitol. We also pray that you would guide our lawmakers around the obstacles